In order to use SAP HANA as a data source in Analysis Edition for OLAP, you must first create an OLAP connection to the SAP HANA cube in the Central Management Console or the Information Design Tool. In this tutorial, you will create an OLAP connection to SAP HANA in the CMC, and then insert the data source into Analysis Edition for OLAP. Note that you must have administrative privileges to the CMC in order to create a new OLAP connection. Log in as the administrator. Type password, and then click Log on. Create a new OLAP connection. Click OLAP Connections. Click New Connection. Define a name and provider for the connection. Click in the name text box. Type SAP HANA, and then click the provider list. Select SAP HANA. Now define the server and port number for SAP HANA. Click in the server text box. Type the server name, and then click in the port text box. Note that the port number always starts with 3, followed by the instance number, and ends with 15. Type 30815, and then click Connect. Enter the credentials for the SAP HANA system. Type R Jones, and then click in the second text box. Type Password, and then click OK. Select the appropriate cube for the connection. Click to scroll down. Click to expand the I818938 folder. Select the ANE Fashion Cube. Click Select. Note that you can choose to prompt for authentication when the connection is selected in one of the client tools, or have the credentials predefined. For this example, leave the default setting. Save the connection, and close the CMC. Click Save. Click Log Off. Next, log in to BI Launchpad, and access Analysis Edition for OLAP. Type Password, and then click Log On. Click Analysis Edition for OLAP. Use the new connection as the data source. Select the SAP HANA connection. Click OK. You are prompted to log on to the SAP HANA system. Enter the same credentials as you used to create the connection. Type R Jones, and then click in the Password text box. Type Password, and then click OK. Note that the values for the cube now display in the workspace. You have successfully inserted a data source using an OLAP connection to SAP HANA. This is the end of the tutorial.